Extortion 17, uh, the, the military will say it was a one in a million shot. But uh, in my opinion, not as a military expert, but as an American, with the facts that uh, Karen and I have, have discovered and the information that's been put before us and the way that our military is operating, extortion, the shoot down of Extortion 17 was a sympt is a symptom of a far bigger problem in our military today. It, it was a calamity waiting to happen. Why is that? Well, <clears throat> the things that we discovered, that we have discovered, uh, the night, first of all, SEAL Team 6, Tier, tier 1 operators that night were uh, blended on an operation, if you will, with uh, National Guard and Army Reservists uh, on a 1960-some-odd model CH-47D National Guard helicopter. The chopper flew into a three-and-a-half-hour uh, firefight where an operation was already underway with no pre-assault fire because of the rules of engagement, because of the winning the hearts and minds strategy that uh, we're employing in Afghanistan. Um, <clears throat> the chopper had seven Afghans on board that night. Here again, when in the hearts and minds, our, our, our forces, our special operators are required to take Afghans along with them. And, and according to, since Aaron's died, according to some SEALs and Rangers that I've spoken with, Mr. Vaughn, they just drag us down. They just slow us down. But this is what our government wants is, is appeasement of our allies, so-called allies and the enemy. Seven Afghans with them that night who were not the men whose names were listed on the manifest. We know that's a fact. The DOD knows it. It's in the military records, yet the DOD has not explained it to the families yet. There could be a simple explanation. Uh, in 2009, we adopted the COIN strategy in Afghanistan. From the beginning of the conflict in Afghanistan up until 2009, it took eight years for the first 1,000 American lives to be lost in Afghanistan. Since the adoption of the corn strategy since uh, in 2009, it took 27 months for the second 1,000 deaths to occur, American deaths to occur in Afghanistan. Number, numbers do not lie, yet no one is talking about this. These are the same warriors, same training, different commander-in-chief, different strategy. Um, that's why Extortion 17 was lost that night. It, arrogance of an administration and of high-ranking military leaders that, that think that you can take men who have been trained general purpose forces who, who are extremely important to our national security, special operators who are extremely important to our national security, but bo both do different things. Think that you can mix them in their varied ways that they train for the first time in a theater of war and think or, or, or assume that you will not have a calamity like this take place. Sheer arrogance and stupidity on the part of our government.